it's done, how uh, confident are you in the female pass rush? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, today was the first day of pads, you know. Um, we're really, you know, with the three guys we got up front that came that last year played ball, we're, we're confident with them. We think they're better. They're doing some good things. And with those guys inside and the guys we have outside, I think we'll be in a better situation with, you know, answering your question with Rush. But, but right now, to be honest with you, with the young guys, you know, today was the first day of pads, so that's always a reality check, you know. But, um, you know, all we're trying to get them to do is um, – you know, accept our expectations in terms of, you know, playing with effort, playing with toughness, playing with discipline. And I'll be honest with you guys, this generation of kid, really, you start from, you know, ground zero. You teach them how to listen. You know, you say, hey, what day of the week it is, and they tell you January. <laughs> so, you know, we're really trying to get them to listen, understand that this is a process, and don't get frustrated with expectations or what your mom and dad are wanting you to do or what, you know, you guys want them to do. Let's just go out and work hard, work right every day, and be the best we can be. How crucial is it to get that pressure once the season gets here consistently every every game, every quarter, every snap? Oh, you talking about in terms of pass rush? Yeah. I mean, well, the hell, everybody wants a good pass rush. It affects it affects the game, but um, you know, that's something you know we're going to game plan and have the guys prepare to do. How difficult is that first hit for the younger guys? I don't think it's difficult in terms of. Doing it physically, I just think psychologically, when you got a guy like Zadarius Hutchinson or a guy like Zach Bailey come off the ball and rock you, you haven't been hit like that before. So you got to get acclimated to it, just like you got to get acclimated to playing in the heat. But um, like I said, we just, you know, they go one play at a time. That's why we tell them to focus on where, and keep, you know, where their feet are, be where their feet are. And um, they're doing a good job of that. First day, you know, first week really that we've been in pads working ball, they're doing a good job. Who's running with your first team right now? Right now, Javon and Kier. Adams on the end and um, Aaron Stearns on the other end. But really, guys, in this time of year, you know, I know, I know for y'all's purposes and what y'all are trying to get done, you know, depth charts are really important and all. But really for us, it's an organizational deal. You know, we have different people at first team, different people at second team. It don't really mean anything. It's just an opportunity for them to get reps with different people and see what they can do against different people. So, you know, and you know, it's a team. It's a team mentality. It's not a us against them mentality. So we're just trying to develop quality depth and play consistent winning football. When you look at some of the young guys, do you expect at least one or two are, are going to have to contribute on the interior this season? Well, numbers would tell you that, but I don't really put any expectations on them. I just want them to do right, practice right, learn to prepare, learn to play the game the way we want it played. And um, you know, at the end of the day, our goal is to play winning football consistently. That's what we want them to do.